let's talk about job success. This is a big problem for many people. However, you can always have a successful job if you will change your thinking about work. You will never find working a pleasure if you hate your job or you can't stand your boss. What a terrible affirmation that is. It will be impossible for you to ever attract a great job with that belief system. If you want to enjoy your time at work, then you must change your thinking. I'm a great believer in blessing with love every person, place, and thing at the workplace. Begin with your current job. Affirm that this job is merely a stepping stone to far greater positions. You are in your current job because of the things you believed in the past. You drew it to you by your thinking. Perhaps you learned your attitude towards work from your parents. No matter, you can change your thinking now. So bless with love your boss, your co-workers, the location, the building, the stairs or elevators, the rooms, the furniture, and each and every customer. This creates a loving mental atmosphere within you, and the whole office will respond to it. I have never understood the reasoning behind putting down or berating others at work. If you are an owner, a manager, or a supervisor, how can you possibly expect to get the best work from others if they are frightened or resentful? We all want to be appreciated, acknowledged, and encouraged. If you support your employees and give them respect, then they will give you the best work they can. Now, please don't believe that it is hard to get a job. That may be true for many, but it does not have to be true for you. You only need one job, and your consciousness will open the pathway for you. Don't have faith in fear. When you hear of negative trends in business or in the economy, immediately affirm, that may be true for some, but it is not true for me. I always prosper no matter where I am or what is going on. People often ask me for the affirmations to make their relationships at work be smoother. In fact, for many people, this is a really big issue in their lives. I am deeply aware that whatever I give out comes back to me multiplied, and this is true everywhere, including at work. In the workplace, it is important to know that every employee and employer has been attracted by the action of love, for it's his and her divine right place here and now at this point in time and space. Divine harmony permeates us all, and we can all flow together in the workplace in a most productive and joyous way. There aren't any problems that don't have solutions. There aren't any questions without answers. Choose to go beyond the problem to seek the divine right action solution to any discord that may seem to appear. Be willing to learn from any discord or confusion as it comes up. It's important to release all blame and turn within to seek the truth. And be willing to release whatever pattern may be in your consciousness that has contributed to the situation. Know that you are successful in all that you do. You're inspired and productive. You serve others willingly and gladly. Divine harmony reigns supreme within and around you and within and around each and every person in your workplace. When you know and declare that it's possible to successfully operate in the workplace according to divine principles, then divine love brings to you those who can be helped by that which you so lovingly do. Now, if you like your job but feel you're not getting paid enough, then bless your current salary with love. Expressing gratitude for what you do have enables it to grow. And absolutely no more bitching about the job or coworkers. Your consciousness put you where you are now. Your changing consciousness can lift you to a better position. You can do it. During your workday, there are a number of things you can do to release tension. Here are a few ideas. One. Before you go to work every day, do this simple exercise. Just sit comfortably and concentrate on your breath. Whenever you notice thoughts coming in, gently bring your awareness back to your breath. 
Give yourself at least 10 or 15 minutes to dwell in the silence each day. There is nothing difficult or tricky to this, and it's worth taking the time. 2. Write or type this affirmation and put it where you can see it at work. My job is a peaceful haven. I bless my job with love. I put love in every corner, and my job lovingly responds with warmth and comfort. I am at peace. When you start to think about your boss, say this affirmation to yourself. I only give out that which I wish to receive. My love and acceptance of others is mirrored to me in every way. Refuse to be limited in any way by human mind thinking. Your life can be filled with love and joy because your work is a divine idea. Remember to say to yourself every day before going to work, No matter where I am, there is only infinite good, infinite wisdom, infinite harmony, and love. Positive Affirmations for Job Success The joy I find in my career is reflected in my overall happiness. At my job, my co-workers and I encourage each other's growth and success. The perfect job is looking for me, and we are being brought together now. I truly believe that we are here to bless and prosper each other. I reflect this belief in my daily interactions. When it is time for a new job, the perfect position presents itself easily. Opportunities are everywhere. I have unlimited choices. Working together is part of the purpose of life. I love the people I work with. I deserve to have a successful career, and I accept it now. Everyone I encounter at work today has my best interests at heart. I am very good at giving encouragement and positive feedback to others. I have unlimited potential. Only good lies before me. My workspace is a pleasure to be in. There is mutual respect among my co-workers. <laughs> 